If you play a contact sport, what should you know about concussion and health risks? Not being the most active person around, I asked Doug Martini, a PhD student in the University of Michigan Neurosport Research Laboratory, for his top five list of things everyone should know. 1. If you've potentially suffered a concussion, you should get an early and accurate diagnosis. If you don't, you run the risk of prolonging symptoms like headache, dizziness and confusion. 2. Follow-up care is important. Concussion is a result of changes in your brain after your head's been hit, and if further harm occurs before it's had time to heal, more serious damage could result. That's why it's recommended that concussed sports players follow a graduated and supervised return to play. 3. It's not yet clear what the long-term health impacts of concussion might be, but there are indications that multiple concussions aren't necessarily good for you. Research has shown, for instance, that if you sustain multiple concussions, your brain function may be affected for up to six years after the injury. 4. Multiple head impacts that don't lead to a diagnosis of concussion may also be significant. Studies show that repeated blows to the head over time in young people can lead to changes in how their brain behaves. It's not yet clear what this means for their health, but the indications are that you should probably avoid getting hit on the head repeatedly if you play a contact sport. 5. Helmets are designed to stop skull fractures, not prevent concussion. Concussions result from your brain being shaken about when your head takes a blow. While helmets may take some of the edge off this, they can't prevent it altogether. Because of this, efforts to reduce concussion-related health risks include changing how athletes behave on the field and introducing better ways of managing and caring for their health. For more information on concussion and contact sports, please do check the links in the blurb below and remember to let us know what you think in the comments.